and visible to all of you just let me know quickly in the chat box if i'm audible and visible as well great cool so uh, i have come here live because uh, the j advance examination happened uh, yesterday and the whole academic year is coming to an end and the new year begins and a lot of students had this uh, query uh, saying uh, sir need 2025 was difficult need 2024 was easy what if need 2026 is diff very very hard very tough what if physics is very hard and 27 students also were scared about that so you know don't worry i have come here to talk to all of you right from the heart and also from the mind because this is not just a game of mind but it is also about emotions because this concept of difficult paper or easy paper you know uh, is being played emotionally as well as mentally so let me give an example okay listen in carefully and yeah smash that like button in case you have forgotten to do so uh, one of my friends invited me to attend a, a movie and uh, he said that it was a comedy movie okay so i was very excited because i love comedy movies and if you uh, love comedy movies just let me know quickly in the chat box so then i got to know after half an hour i was waiting for the jokes and i'm like where is the comedy and then i get to know that it is not a comedy because suddenly one ghost came and freaked out it really really freaked us out i was not expecting that ghost and i was like to my friend you didn't even tell me it was a horror movie you could have just told me then i realized that with the same friend with the same friend previously we have watched horror movies and he had told me okay this is a horror movie and uh, you know what it's scary it's crazy and all of that and because he had told us that it is a horror movie i was expecting the ghost will come now okay the ghost will come then and when the ghost came yeah i, I kind of expected it and my friend told me exactly the same thing and that's when i realized probably this is what went wrong with neat 20 you guys expected a comedy show but it was a horror show if somebody probably would have again and again told you no it's a horror show it's a horror show you would have expected it to be a horror show last 4 5 years the papers have been fairly easy fairly predictable everyone on youtube says you know i leaked the paper i leaked the paper i i have predicted this and frankly speaking even what we said came in the paper what we have predicted also came in the paper many times but the funny part is this time whatever things came in the examination it's not like it was not predicted in fact i have told you many of these concepts in fact i can prove it to you how many concepts which you have done in the class actually came in the examination but the problem is the expectation of the lengthiness the calculation the difficulty of the question added to that the 3 hours of time limit and no choice in the questions so students perceived it as difficult many students did not complete biology on time instead of 50 minutes they took 1 hour 15 minutes instead of and they thought that okay biology was lengthy okay maybe chemistry will be fine but chemistry was also moderate and they ended up completing the paper in 2 hours 15 minutes or 2 hours 20 minutes and hardly 40 minutes was left for physics which was definitely not sufficient easily you would have taken 90 minutes to solve the physics paper if you remember correctly we had told before also will not make high weightage videos will not tell you which chapters to skip will not tell you priority order in fact i warned you that nta will take revenge i got that idea back in january only but the moment i used to take a difficult problem practice class especially in physics students used to run away students never watched it and i felt very sad that are our need students watching the physics lectures just for marks is it because they don't want to learn the subject and it felt so last year and exactly the repercussions are seen now in the need 2025 if you don't love the subject if you don't feel the subject no matter how much ncert you do 
you will not get marks. And that is exactly what has happened this year. So to deal with a difficult paper, my dear students, first expect the unexpected. First point, expect the unexpected. You should know that you are entering a horror show. Second thing, you know, difficulty is not because the subject is hard. It could be also that you felt that the paper was easy, but the rank was not as expected. Just imagine NEET 2024. It was easy for everyone. Fine, paper leak happened, etc. Forget that. Just keep that aside. The paper was definitely easy. But what's the point? What rank did you get? 720 out of 720, like more than 50 students, above 700, crazy number of students. So when the paper is easy also, it is just that only the time till the result that you are happy. But after that, you will be sad. But when the paper is difficult, the time till the result, you are sad. But after result, you suddenly become happy because you, ex you have got low marks, you expect a bad rank, but it's bad for everyone. So you get a good rank. So you need to know how to tackle both these situations. Frankly, we had those kind of tests last year, but I saw the attendance in those kind of tests, which were theme-based tests. Very calculative, very difficult, biology very difficult, physics very difficult, then chemistry easy, then biology easy, physics hard, all kinds of patterns of tests we had made. But the attendance was very low in such tests. Students just wanted easy, easy ones. And frankly, that made us very sad. But this year, we are again going to do it in a much better way. Having different difficulty levels, having different patterns of the examination, having a very easy exam, having a very calculative exam, having unexpected questions, having questions from start, intro, summary, in text, suddenly from last 30 years, maybe J mains type of question. Which came, in fact, this year, J advanced type of question came in physics. What if next year chemistry is hard? What if chemistry is like crazy hard mixture of physical with inorganic? Very little inorganic comes. What if the paper has more of inorganic? What if the paper has very little 11th and more of 12th? What if the paper has very little 12th and more of 11th? All these kind of exams we are going to make you practice. And by the way, that is going to happen in the DNA batch, which is live right now. It has just started. It's all a part of it. And frankly speaking, this is what is going to help you. So, my dear students, remember, that was the second point. Okay, expect the unexpected. Third thing that you need to do, don't just stick to NCRT. Don't just underline notes from NCRT. That is necessary, but not sufficient. I hope you know the difference between necessary and not sufficient and all of that. So, doing NCRT is a must. But doing a coaching module, solving problems is even more important. In fact, in our Tattva, we have three levels of exercises and we used to take feedback. How many exercises you did? Most of the students used to say, I did exercise one and exercise two max. Exercise three of Tattva is achievers level, beyond the need level. Beyond the need level means it is need level only, but those hard questions of need. Very few people did it. What should a teacher like me say? Like when students don't want to do the hard problems because they feel that the paper will be easy and it's going to happen again and again. So guys, do you think the same trend should continue? Obviously not, right? Can you leave those achievers or leveling up questions? Definitely not. And don't you want me to do such kind of questions on YouTube? Or are you going to say, no, sir, we are going to do only easy stuff. We are not going to attend those difficult kind of questions. Because then, frankly speaking, if it is the same old easy stuff, then might as well watch my old classes. If you want my new classes, it's very simple, guys. You need to commit to yourself and me including in the comment section. Yes, sir, we'll push our limits. Yes, sir, we are the achievers. We'll solve level 3 of Tattva also. Sir, we want difficult questions also. 
apart from the easy ones. Obviously, we'll start from zeros and go to hero level. Sir, we are going to go beyond NCRT. Sir, we are not going to ask you weightage. Sir, we are not going to ask you marks. How many marks will I get from this chapter? How many times this question has come in so many chats? Is this chapter important? What should I say, guys? Honestly, think and tell me. If I say yes, you will study. But what if it doesn't come in the exam? If I say no and you don't study and it comes in the exam, anything can happen. No point looking at priority and weightages, class 11, class 12, trend analysis, blah, blah, blah. Instead of doing that, just study, my dear students. That's what I would say. Are you ready to make this promise? Put up a heart in the chat box quickly. I want to know from you. Are you ready, my dear students? Quickly let me know in the chat box right away, right now. And this is an eye-opener, especially for 2026 and 2027 students. And you have one year in advance that I'm giving you. And yes, if you want to prepare in a very systematic manner, apart from YouTube, YouTube classes will definitely happen. See, YouTube classes are going to be there. But if you want some extra mile test series, you want to push yourself, you want our mentorship, you want our guidance, you want our, you know, lectures in a very different style also. Then guys, please check out the link which is there in the description box, the DNA batch for 2026, pure English, complete syllabus by November with the revision, first time, second time, with mock tests, all India level, with ranking, analysis, different theme-based papers, assignments, tatwa, DPPs, handwritten notes, recordings and also in the replay of the class you can watch sorry you can ask a doubt so post class doubt solving also is there is a part of that particular batch so do not forget to check out check out the link for the dna 2026 batch for freshers and droppers some students will be like sir i'm a fresher i have a school in the morning blah 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 guys you can watch the replay you can find 100 excuses for not doing something but you need just one motivation to do everything in your life. And the DNA batch, frankly, is very cheap right now. Less than 5,000 rupees, you are getting the entire syllabus with the best teachers. I mean, students waste lakhs of rupees on coaching and top of that, they enter into private colleges paying not lakhs, paying crores of rupees. So, I feel bad. And one of my students, a student from this year, 2025, in physics, guess his marks. The claims are more than 160, most likely 165, but we are taking a buffer of more 5 marks. I'm telling you 160 marks out of 180. Can you believe that? It's crazy. And the reason for that? He studied physics properly from us. Imagine with this level of difficulty, he is able to get 160 plus marks out of 180 in need physics. I'm telling you, very few people in the country will be there. Many, many students will not even get above 150, but very few students in the country will get to above 160 this year. And he's one of them. If you want that kind of attitude, you want that kind of marks, guys, start from now. Listen to what I say and I will come over here regularly to guide you. You put your doubt. You feel like I am studying with you. You are sitting here with me and you ask me anything, any stupid question also, we will not mind. Any stupid question, doesn't matter. We are here to help you throughout the NEET 26 journey. Whether you are a part of DNA Batch, whether you are on our YouTube channel, doesn't matter. Just ask us questions. We are there to help you. And if you want that help, please smash that like button. So that this video reaches to every nook and corner, every student who is worried, who is tensed about how to tackle a difficult question paper. I hope I have answered all your doubts and if still there are more doubts, please let me know in the comments. Thank you for liking. Good night. Take care.